We just looked at the picture from before. Mm -hmm. Big difference. Mm -hmm. um, let's see if I can even put the picture side by side. Is That's the nail I looked like before. Let me put it this way. Yeah. Ah, he's flipping. You see the difference? Yeah. So skinny and painful. Now what happens, because the band is slowly opening up the nail, the nail bed underneath that used to be pinched also opens up. So once we take off the band, the nail bed has also expanded. That's, that, that's what's going to allow the nail to not come back in because the nail bed has also opened up. That's the big difference. So let's take this one off so you can see. This does it very, very quick, very easy. It stays on good, but all you need is a little bit of pressure and it comes right off. Okay, if that's not gonna come off, we'll buff it off. And I'm seeing you had a top coat put on. So let me clean that one up as well. So nothing to hurt. Just gonna remove a little bit of this top coat that you have. And we're just going to make sure that the band sticks on well. And now we're going to dehydrate the nail. There's that. And at the same time, I'm going to do the other one. Need some more here, no? Sorry, yeah, I'm gonna buff that down after. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Just getting a little bit of this dead skin out. First, I'm just doing the band, and then mm -hmm. I'll do all the foot care after. Mm -hmm. Now, how much pain are you in with these big toenails, would you say? out of 10? Probably uh, five. And when you first came in, I could barely touch them. <laughs> right? Yeah. And that was the last time we trimmed down the side, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. So it's, it's lasted much longer than it normally would. And it's gonna help the compound stick a little bit better. When do you feel the most discomfort? Is it when it's in your shoes? Sometimes at night. When the sheet's yeah. on it? Yeah. And it didn't come off at all for those, all those months. So what we're going to do, we're going to put it on the widest part of the nail this time. It might not go right to the cuticle, but what we're trying to do is create a much wider band to hold as much of that nail width as possible. Is so what you put lower compared last time? Yes. Well, the other one we put all the way to the back, but you'll see how see how narrow the band was that first one, mm -hmm. from here to here. This one you can see is much wider.
So you can see this band is much, much, much wider than the first one we put on. And that's because we have now more nail to work with. Okay. You can see how much wider. Mm -hmm. That first band was very skinny because <laughs> that's how much of the nail we had before. But now the base, because we made it wider, is definitely much, much wider than before. This is going to be very good. But this is the big, this is the big thing. If you can see from before, your first band went from here to here. See how much wider this next one is? Mm -hmm. Now this one's gonna hold that wide shape. So imagine this width up oh, here. Okay. See how much more it's gonna open up the nail? Mm -hmm. So we're gonna wait for this one to grow all the way to the end and then see how we are. Okay. Okay. So now we're just smoothing everything out now. Okay, you can breathe easy, you made it. And we got that bad piece out that was very, very curved. And it's just to give you more relief as the band works out. It opens up. But even then, it hasn't been bugging you as much as before. <laughs> it looks better now. So ugly. <laughs>